Congress of uh, American Academy of Anti-Aging Medicine and uh, the most top subject is about telomeres and how to stop aging and uh, Mr. Uh, Noel Patton he is the founder and also the CEO of uh, the telomere science research company and as I read you were one of the pioneer with the original team who did uh, the research on telomeres and received the Nobel Prize, is that right? Well, no, um, I personally am not a scientist and um, I've been involved with this for now more than 10 years. Uh, uh, but this molecule that, we, that we're selling, TA65, which is a pill uh, that activates an enzyme called telomerase that makes cells younger. I'll explain that later. But I wasn't involved in the actual research. There were three American scientists and then he, they won the Nobel Prize, Prize yeah. three, year, three years ago for the discovery of this enzyme called yeah. telomerase that we need to e explain okay. to you. Okay. So then what is TA65, the product? You the product uh, TA65 is a, it's a pill and inside is a single molecule. So it's pure like a drug, but it's a nutritional supplement. And you swallow the pill and it the molecule gets into the bloodstream and then it gets into the cells, into the nucleus of the cell where it turns on a gene that is turned off normally and that uh, gene is the, the telomerase gene It turns on an enzyme called telomerase. Explain what telomeres are. Telomeres are the ends of the chromosomes and they get shorter as we age. These are the aging clock aging clocks in every cell, uh, telomeres. So, uh, telomeres are uh, made up of DNA and they're at both ends of every chromosome. And uh, the, in every cell there are 23 pairs of chromosomes, 23 from your mother, mm -hmm. 23 from your father. So you have 46 chromosomes in, in every cell. and the, Chromosomes are long linear things, so there's two ends. So you have two times 46, 92 telomeres in every cell in your body. And the telomeres are the tips at the, at the end. Uh, it's, it's DNA, but there are no genes there. They're just there to protect the integrity of the chromosomes. The best analogy that people give is that the telomeres are like the plastic tip Mm -hmm. at the end of a shoelace. I can mm -hmm. see. Yeah. <laughs> I have a prop here. So that would be the plastic telomere, tip yeah. at the end of a shoelace. Imagine this is a telomere mm -hmm. and the rest of it is the chromosome. Mm -hmm. And at the other end of it, the long thing, there's it's another, the other one. another yeah. one. Okay. So um, every time a cell divides, the telomere gets a little shorter, a little shorter, and a little shorter. Yeah. And when it gets too short, the then shoelace, it yeah. frays, frays and, and it's no longer protected mm -hmm. and the shoelace, now it won't work anymore mm -hmm. on my shoe and when the, uh, and the chromosome gets frayed, mm -hmm. it also doesn't work, it dies or mm -hmm. becomes senescent. A, senescent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So telomeres are the protective tips okay. at the ends of the chromosomes mm -hmm. and every time a cell divides, they get shorter, mm -hmm. shorter, shorter, shorter. It's the aging clock. Mm -hmm. in every cell. So uh, this shortening telomere signals the rest of the cell to age. Mm -hmm. Because why, do you, why is it that the skin on my hand doesn't look like today, doesn't look today like it did when I was a baby? Mm -hmm. I have the same genes. My DNA is the same as it was mm -hmm. when I was a baby. What's the difference? 
The difference is that some of my genes are turned on, that were turned off when I was a baby, and some are turned off now when they were turned on. It's called gene expression. It's the, it's the, the genes that are expressed means whether they're turned on or mm -hmm. turned off. Mm -hmm. So if we could cure every disease known to mankind, we would still die before we hit 120 because we never got sick, we never had a disease, but our cells just couldn't function anymore. Mm -hmm. So that's what uh, our, our product is activating this enzyme, telomerase. Telomerase has the unique, almost miraculous ability to regrow the telomeres. The tel so actually regrow it, not just stop the shortening, but not it will regrow it. Actually re regrow the, the telomeres by adding DNA back to at the, the, at the so end. So we can get younger. You can get uh, cells <laughs> younger if we could uh, get our TA65 into every cell in the body, mm -hmm. we really would get younger. But we have 100 trillion cells in the body and we only get into some of those cells. We don't know for sure all of them. We know we get into bone marrow, uh, which makes all the new blood cells. Yes. But we can't do brain biopsies or heart biopsies mm -hmm. to really see what's if happening. The way yeah. we measure is we take blood mm -hmm. and then we look to see uh, how long the telomeres are in the different So that's cells. the test of the telomere testing that uh, there are some companies doing that now. Is that that's right. You yeah. can test your telomeres. Mm -hmm. we, we strongly recommend it. If you test the length of your telomeres, it's, this tells you your biological age mm -hmm. as opposed to your chronological age. You know, if I, you show me your driver's license, uh, I, then I know your chronological age. Mm -hmm. It's the day you were born, how many years you lived. But everybody's biological age is, is different than their chronological age. Mm -hmm. You've noticed, I'm sure, that some people that are, they, they look really young for their age and, and they act young and so on. Others, just the opposite. They, they're old before their time. Mm -hmm. And that, so that's the, um, uh, that's the biological mm -hmm. age that we're concerned about. So if you measure your telomeres, it, it gives you com uh, how old you yes. how old you what really are biologically. Mm -hmm. So how do how can we get hold of this wonder drug T sixty five? Is it? You, it's, we don't sell to drug stores, health food stores. Uh, we sell through doctors, but not just every doctor. Doctors who are licensed by us to know about telomere biology. At what age somebody <coughs> can start to take this? Well, we recommend for age 40 and over. Mm -hmm. If we have three dose levels for young people, middle-aged people, and older people. And by young people, we mean from 40 to say 50, 55. Middle age is 55 to 65 or 70. And older age is say, say 70 and, and up. Uh, so you, it's just a rough guide, but you take one pill a day if you're young, <laughs> our example, mm -hmm. two if you're middle, uh, and the, the full dose is four pills a day. Well, thank you very much, and you definitely brought hope <laughs> into our life. <laughs>